With the upcoming election on November 5th, question three poses the question to voters on whether or not rideshare workers such as Uber and Lyft drivers have the right to unionize. A yes vote would be in favor of rideshare workers' rights to negotiations of salary and better working conditions. Major corporations oppose this ballot measure due to foreseen legal issues in the specifics of the bill. We talked to Uber drivers and others to learn more. In a statement, Massachusetts Fiscal Alliance said, Question three does not really create bargaining for our workers. Drivers will have no control over leadership of the union and will pay significant dues without real representation. This proposal is not fair to drivers and allows just two and a half percent of drivers to force unionization and leaves many drivers without a voice. Roxana Riviera of United for Justice argues that a yes vote will give Massachusetts rideshare drivers who work for companies like Uber and Lyft the option to join a union while also maintaining driver flexibility and independence. The option to join a union is guaranteed for most workers, but rideshare drivers currently don't have that choice. Vote yes to allow rideshare drivers the option to choose a union. In a statement, Lyft said, while we have no plans to oppose the ballot measure, we do have some concerns about specific aspects of its language and will work collaboratively to address them in the next legislative session should the measure pass my position on question three for uh, the right for um, uber and lyft drivers to unionize is i i don't really understand um i understand unions but i don't understand why we would need a union it's really a self-employed position i don't know i think it's fine the way it is i don't so i i I voted not, not to have a union. Thanks for watching. To learn more about question three, visit the link on the screen.